Hello everyone and welcome back to the Hunter Call of the Wild. Today I wanna give you guys a bit of heads up what is going on with some of the callers in the game. I have found severe issue with the callers and animals that are near water. It has seriously handicapped my whole gameplay and game the playstyle. And I just want to let you guys know about the issue, showcase it and then I'm gonna bug report it later after I'm done with this. I have some clips here that I've shot where, where I go through what is going on and what is happening. There are some ways you can circulate the issue and I'm also talking about those in these clips. Remember to like and subscribe if you enjoy the video and find this helpful. And now let's get to the clips. Look guys, I found a new pet. Taking some screenshots of this red deer that is clearly very bugged. It's following me, that's quite disturbing that it's doing such a thing. I'm here at, in the Avarova just checking out my red deer zones. Because somewhere around there, I had a level 9. Oh, there's a mythical now. I had a level 9 red deer that I, I've seen once. And I have no clue where this guy have gone. I did take a shot at him, but it was a horrendous shot, and he did not die, and my game crashed after. So I have a feeling he should still be around. Well, now he went. <laughs> Goodbye. That took you long enough. And last time I was here trying to find the level 9, I ran into a quite severe, severe issue with the bow hunting and especially with the callers I'm gonna try if I can replicate it this time too but the main thing was that when you use a caller from a from another side of a lake so you have water between you and the animals the animals will just get stuck they would not move they would not do anything they will just stand around completely still and I couldn't get the animals to come to my call at all, no matter what I did. They, they, did, they didn't care at all. So this time I'm gonna go and put tripod maybe somewhere there. See if it's not too close to these guys. And see if this is still happening. Was it just one time thing? I had it happen several times in different, different places too, so... I am quite confident that it, it's gonna happen again. Okay, now I'm too close. So I need to put the stand somewhere like here. And let's see, if I use a caller. Let's hop in. Before anything, let's see, are there any deer running away? I don't see it. These guys are all still very calm. Okay, let's see, I'm gonna use the caller. See if I can get any of them to come. Hello. Okay, this guy is coming. There's the mythical. Now, are they gonna do same as last time and just... Okay, this guy is coming. Good. It happened again. You can see these guys. They are traveling, like the mythical one. He's traveling. But he's just standing. This guy is calm, but he's he stopped running. He came that far. Let's call them again and see if I can get them to come closer. Okay, this hind is going back. Can they not cross here? They can for sure. This guy stopped going anywhere. All of these are completely frozen. <laughs> As you can see. They're supposed to travel. They're all traveling. So they are coming to the call. This guy started to come. But then he just stopped there. Where that one hind went? But uh, if you are hunting near the water. 
Especially if you want to use the... Okay, this guy is slowly coming. If you want to use the caller, and if you are a bow hunter or want to get animals close, be aware, because this thing apparently can happen. The red deer here has had the most difficult time to actually come to the call. Okay, the stag has went somewhere. Is the stag coming in? They're all traveling. But nothing happens. And I have something coming in here. It's probably the hind. Okay, there's the hind. So one out of, what is that, at least ten came to the call. She's circling. So let's take her out. Should do it. Yep. And uh, any of these guys are moving. There's one moving. Okay, they're going back to drink. This guy is also drinking. I'm gonna give them a bit time. See if getting them back to drink is actually gonna help. Because now they're actually back moving. If this stays for a long time, it's gonna be extreme pain to bow hunt. And that is honestly just taking the enjoyment out of the game for me as of now. I really just wanted to get back to the game, play it my way, which you guys know it is bow hunting. But if I can't call the animals to me, it's really hard to do it. <laughs> okay, the musical is moving. What happens now if I call? Does that help? They are traveling. They are calm. This lady is walking. And this tag is just... Going somewhere. I have no clue what he's doing. He actually might be coming in here. Okay, so we have one stag coming in. Hello. There we go. He is down. Died in the water. <laughs> Hi. If I'm going there, can I call them in from the from top of the hill? They're back to drinking. So let's try this out. I'm gonna go down. It's a nice double lung shot on the level 6 male. Did they just leave? Wait, what? Am I am I dumb? What what, 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 what happened? How on earth did I spook them? The wind is great. They were hundred and something meters away, hundred and thirty meters away. I haven't shot weapon. Only thing I did was that I took down the tripod. This one I did not expect. Something wonky going on with this guy's behavior. That is not normal. I ran like 5 seconds, 130 meters away from them. And I have all the noise dampening skills maxed. So I'm making less noise than you normally are. So that shouldn't be an, it shouldn't be any issue. And now I lost the mythical. <laughs> yeah, the mythical just ran away. And now if I want to test the caller once again, I need to wait for them to go back to calm from nervous. That is of course not an issue if the animals and the callers work properly. But as you saw, this is a huge setback for bow hunters. Okay, I'm gonna put tripod up here so it's far away from them, 130 meters. Okay, I'm gonna wait till they go back to calm. And I call these guys in and see if this kind of land, there's a bit water here. And there is water between me and the animals. If that spot is gonna make it harder for them to come through. Um, I feel like I'm sitting slightly, <laughs> slightly uncomfortable here. <laughs> what? What am I sitting on? 
Oh no. That's... That's not good. <laughs> oh, it actually is broken. What I was sitting on. Elite sniper tripod stands. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I'm gonna move the stand slightly to the left. Huh? Where did that come from? Came from that side. Okay, are these guys calm? Nope, they're nervous, but I'm still gonna call if this guy is the... Mythical. Oh, it's a massive level 5. Coming in hot. Coming in very hot. Let's take him out. Should not go too far. No, he's gonna just die there. Good night, Prince. Did it affect these guys? I don't think so. Nope. Okay, all of them are now back to calm state. Uh, if you want to know how long it took for them to go from nervous to calm, I will put an time estimation now on the screen in the edit, since I can measure the time in there. But uh, let's see. Back to testing the caller. Can they come to me when there is this amount of water in between? If they had the whole lake, like one portion of the lake, they did not come. Or really rare of them. They... Now, how many of these guys is now gonna come? That looks better. Okay, that looks way better than before. We have two who are stuck. Are these guys gonna come all the way? That's my question. So they are not coming through here. So if there is any water in... Can they even cross here? You can, that's a shallow water. So we have the first one to come in. It's a level 4. I don't think I saw level 4 in there before. So at least in this case, most of them can circle. So that means you only need to worry about it if you have larger amount of water in between you and animals. If you want them to actually come to the call. Okay, this guy, they made circle around. They didn't cross it so it seems like that the water is cutting their navigation almost completely at some point uh, there was a similar issue long long time ago where you could not call in animals if there was a water between you and them so this seems to be similar than what it was before it's a funny fun thing that the same old bug is somehow back into the game and also what I would really like to know is what spook these guys when I came here. I would really love to know what spooked them. What? Okay, should be okay. Yeah, I got it. Down he goes. It's a single lung, but he's gonna die. There we go. Now, do I have any deer left behind? Yes, the other level 6 was left behind there. So I'm just gonna take him with the 303. So, that kind of proves it. If you are doing some bow hunting or you want to use the stands, and especially the callers, the callers are the main thing here that have issues. Do not have water between you and the animal you want to call in. And as you saw, it severely limits the animal's navigation. They are not coming into the call at all. So that's something you can you need to keep in mind. I don't know how many species this affects. I haven't tested a lot of them, but especially here at Avaroa, red deer are really really bad. It's 
frustratingly enough that I have to make a video out of it. You guys know I'm not a huge fan of making bug videos and stuff, but uh, if I run into something that severely limits the gameplay, such as this one, this completely kills bow hunting near water. 100%. And uh, if you if you are a bow hunter like me, I would highly just suggest either placing yourself in a place where you have no water at all, or just don't use the bow. <laughs> That's that sounds rough, and believe me, it hurts my soul. But uh, there's not much else we can do. If you guys have found uh, other issues like this, if you have found that animals are not coming to the calls or other bugs that are related to the, especially for the bow hunting let me let me and the others know in the comments down below the bow hunting is in my opinion the best part of the game and uh, this thing this one really kills the whole enjoyment of the bow hunt it's a nice looking level 7 there it is it's roughly two, 300 meters so Yep, that's a double lung. Down he goes. And here we have this nice level 7. Gonna pick this guy up. It's a nice double lung shot from 284 meters. The 303 is not the most powerful weapon. But it's still doing its job on the red tier. So, that's all I have for you guys today. I usually don't like doing this kind of videos, but this issue was such a severe and it handicapped the bow hunting. Especially in my game style, it handicapped my play style almost completely to a halt. So if you enjoy the bow hunting, I really, really wanted to let you guys know that pay attention how you position yourself with the animals and the water. Now it seems to be really important so you can circle, cir circulate this issue. And you can actually use the code and get the animals to come in. If you have run into any issues or you would like to report them, please report them straight to Expansive World so they know what is going on and they can get to fix, the, fi fix them. Just talking about it online is not automatically giving them bug reports. So please post the ticket. I will post my own after I'm done with this video. So if you enjoyed the video, like and subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you for watching, as, and as always, have fun, happy hunting, and I see you on the next one. Bye bye.